We're currently living through a new age of information with AI and everyone now has unlimited access to knowledge at their fingertips. And I'm a firm believer that almost anybody can learn any subject or skill with time, dedication, and AI tools. And in this video, I'll be showing you the absolute best way to learn any subject or skill using Google's AI tool called Notebook LM. Now, Notebook LM is a free AI tool from Google that allows you to analyze websites, files, and YouTube videos. You can think of it as a virtual research assistant that can analyze data and information that you provide to it. So how it works is that you can attach up to 50 sources, and from these sources, you can either summarize the information, create study guides, or even ask questions about the information presented inside the source. And if you're more of an audio learner, you can even create a podcast based on the source. So think of Notebook LM as a data analyst where you just need to upload the data yourself. In a time where people are constantly looking for AI to replace entire workflows or tasks, I feel like not enough people are utilizing AI to better themselves and expand their own knowledge. And tools like Notebook LM will really help you become a superhuman by learning technical subjects with complete accuracy. You can essentially become knowledgeable in fields within a few weeks by having top information that's easily digestible. So let's now get started using Notebook LM. So when you first head over into Notebook LM, you can create a new notebook and you can think of notebooks as essentially projects. So if we want to create a new project within Notebook LM, let's click create here. And from this notebook, we can have the ability to upload sources, chat with the sources we upload, and then we also have a studio section. So the key thing to note here is that all the answers that you get from Notebook LM inside this chat section will be based on the sources that you upload. So by providing information through sources, you can essentially validate every single answer that Notebook LM gives you. And this really solves the constant hallucination that you'll typically see with most conversational LLMs. So now let's try this out with the original Bitcoin white paper. So this is a PDF document that just details how Bitcoin works and why we need it. So to get started, let's first add the source of the Bitcoin white paper. So what we can do is upload the source. Let's go ahead and choose our Bitcoin PDF here. So now we can see on the left hand side, Bitcoin is uploaded and on the right hand side inside this chat section, it first provides us with a very general summary, but we can do a lot better. So what we want to do is essentially explain the Bitcoin white paper in more layman's terms. We are now provided once this loads with a summary. And the cool thing about Notebook LM is like I mentioned, everything is accurate. So with every single statement that it makes, so basically after every single sentence, you have sources that point to where they're receiving this information from. So from the start, we can see it introduces Bitcoin, a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system, completely fine. We have the problem, we have the solution, we have all of the different timestamps, proof of work sections, network operations. But the cool thing here is that every single sentence has a source attached to it so that you can validate yourself whether the information is right or wrong. And this really adds to the accuracy of using Notebook LM to essentially learn any complex or technical topic. And Notebook LM isn't just for summarizing complex sources. You can also ask questions about the sources as well. Now, obviously, this Bitcoin white paper isn't too terribly long. It's only nine pages. But if we wanted to really hone in on, say, like a 300 page document, we could ask very specific questions and get accurate answers. But for our case, let's just say what problems does Bitcoin solve? From here, we can hone in on a very specific section of the document and have Notebook LM provide, once again, accurate answers with proper sources for each section that they give inside their outputs. And if you want some further help learning topics, you can also add different types of notes. So there's some pre-made ones here on Notebook LM. We can create a study guide for memory retention. So if you click study guide here, Notebook LM will actually generate a study guide for you. Kind of as a quick reference, it'll summarize basically this entire PDF into one easy to digest study guide that you can quickly look over and learn the key concepts of. And apart from study guides, we also have briefing docs, FAQs, so these can be common answers and questions on the source as well as the timeline now apart from this general chat section and notes we can also create podcasts if you're more of an audio learner for complex sources so inside this section we can create a deep dive conversation which is basically just a podcast to help you learn complex topics in a more digestible format here we're able to either customize or generate a podcast based on our source so I've gone ahead and uploaded a very complex reinforcement learning source. So rather than reading through the entire PDF, all 400 pages of it, we can just make a podcast out of it and have the information be more easily accessible. So before we generate the podcast, we can first customize rules essentially for the podcast. So inside this customization section, we can say 
please focus on all the beginner topics of reinforcement learning. And then we can also say to please include analogies whenever possible. And then now let's generate a podcast based on this massive document. Our 18 minute podcast is now ready. So let's take a listen and see how well Notebook LM did here. Hey everyone and welcome back. Today we're going deep uh, into a topic that might sound kind of intimidating at first, but trust me, it's super fascinating. Definitely. We're talking about reinforcement learning or RL. Yeah. It's basically how computers can learn all on their own. Like uh kind of like, like how you you know got good at that video game you love, but for for robots and algorithms. Exactly. Our guide for this deep dive is the the book. So as you can see, the podcast honestly seems like a genuine conversation between two real people, and they're even incorporating some of the customization rules we set in the beginning, like adding analogies to make the complex topics a little bit more easy to understand. Plus, if you want to dive further, there's also this interactive mode, which is currently in beta, but you'll actually be able to interact with the podcast hosts and ask questions as the podcast is going on. Now let's go over some additional use cases for Notebook LM. So one thing we can also use Notebook LM for is to analyze code. So in sources, let's click upload a source and we can select a website URL and paste in a GitHub link. So what I have here on this other tab is just a DeepSeek Coder GitHub repo. So let's go ahead and copy over this URL and then paste it as a source for our notebook here. We can now chat with the code base so we can summarize it in plain English and we can also ask what parts of the code does what. So let's go ahead and just ask perhaps some of the default questions that are recommended. So how does DeepSeek Coder leverage large language models to enhance code generation? We have the answers once again with sources for every single output. We can also ask further questions. So like I mentioned, this is just a great way to learn especially if you aren't technical enough to understand every single section of the repo, you can have Notebook LM essentially summarize things for you in a more digestible way. So moving on, Notebook LM can also analyze YouTube videos, which is great if you want to learn from lectures or very dense videos that are pasted on the YouTube platform. So inside sources here, we can upload a source and we have a section for specifically pasting in YouTube links. So over here in the second tab, I just pulled up a lecture on power electronics from MIT. Now, like most of the other MIT lectures, it's pretty dense and filled with information. So from learning, we can go ahead and copy this link, paste it inside this YouTube URL insert. And now once Notebook LM verifies the source, once again, just like all of our other PDFs, we can ask questions on the video. We once again, will have answers with sources. So in our section here, we can just say, like I mentioned, just like our previous Notebook LM examples, we'll once again have sources for every single section. Now, the only requirements for YouTube videos is that it needs to have captions because that's how Notebook LM takes the information out. But once again, these can be auto-generated, so most YouTube videos should work. And it needs to be less than 500,000 words, which again, most YouTube videos should fit that criteria. And now as a final use case, I've also found that Notebook LM is great at analyzing financial statements. So in this section here, I've uploaded a few 10Ks and 10Qs of NVIDIA, which are financials for the quarter and for the year. You can also upload earnings transcripts, maybe go through some research companies and upload investor presentations. And then after uploading these sources, you can even ask, um, I'm possibly interested in investing. How do these earnings reports or transcripts look to you? So for us here, let's just type in. And obviously the more sources you have, the better. So with a massive company like NVIDIA, We'll have access to all of their public financial statements, which you can upload essentially 50 of them if you really wanted to, as well as all different types of investor presentations and earnings reports. And once again, for your answers, you have sources for every single thing that Notebook LM states. The sky is honestly the limit when learning with Notebook LM as long as you have powerful and accurate sources to provide. Now, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more weekly AI content. And make sure to check us out at AICodePathways.com, where we teach complete AI skills for beginners.